Disclaimer, this video is totally made up on fiction. Nothing is related to reality. Ignore my mistakes. It's totally imaginary. Nothing is related to idols real life. Don't take it seriously. I'm not encouraging anyone to get influenced by it. The voice in the video is mine. Picture credit goes to the owner. Please don't copy my content. The young heart stopped. He couldn't feel his straight after she went unconscious in his arms. He lifted her and took her to their room. Jimin, who just came there, saw him taking wine to room. He also ran behind them. Taeyong made her lay in bed. His body was shivering with fear. He saw her neck where there was. His eyes were getting red, but he didn't lose his control. Taeyong, darling, please wake up. Soon, Jimin came. Jimin, oh my god, Taeyong, Jimin, she, Jimin, she, don't try, let me check. Jimin checked her pulse. Jimin, there, her pulse is getting low, you have to save her. Taeyong, no Jimin, I can't, I promise her, also, it will be risky for baby. Jimin, are you crazy? Her life is important, not promise. About baby, nothing will happen. Just be careful. Tang didn't say anything. Jimin, I can't stay here there. It's not easy for me. Good luck. He hugged there and went out. Tang looked at Vine and his tear fall. Vampire King, who didn't cry in his whole life, was now crying for a simple girl. Time skip. Brian opened her eyes. Her whole body was. She was feeling too weak. She was not able to move her body. She looked at her side and saw Taeyong in a messy condition. When the Taeyong, when are you okay? When yes I'm okay, why are you crying? Wipe tears with a light smile, just feeling in my body. Taeyong sniff. I When smile when that's why I'm alive, right? Taeyong nodded. Taeyong and her baby too. He kissed her. She opened her arms, inviting him for a hug. He hugged and started sobbing. Wen was surprised. She never saw him this week. Wen, it's okay, Tae. Taeyong, promise me you will take care of yourself and our baby when I will not be here. Went front, she made him face her. When, where are you going? Taeyong, nowhere. He snuggled to her neck. Ben didn't feel good. Like this, few days more passed. Taeyong took care of Ryan very well because she doesn't have enough. Tang was afraid for Ryan, which Ryan can notice very well. Ryan, why are you getting worried? Nothing will happen. Tang, just promise me you will take care in my absence. Ryan, why you always say this, huh? Where are you going? Tang, just promise me first. Ryan, I will. Taeyong hugged her with closed eyes. Then he... Taeyong, now drink this beetroot juice. Ryan, don't tell me. You are going to make me drink. In a few days. Taeyong chuckled.
soon, Brian was seen and doctor was already there and mentioned for her. She was screaming and, and Dayong was seeing it with teary eyes. Brian held his hand, Dayong, her head. Dayong, you can do it. Take care. Brian frowned and cried, but he left her hand and went out. Wen cried more for him. She need him right now. After a lot of struggles, a little baby girl was born. Wen cried while taking the baby in her arms. After a few hours, Wen asked, Where is Dayong? But nobody knows. Jimin was also not there. Wen wanted to see him. She was too weak to handle the baby, and she needs her husband right now. She was crying, seeing the little figure laying by her side. She closed her eyes and let her tear fall. Soon, the door opened and Jimin entered inside with a smile. She saw him and tried to sit. Jimin helped her. Jimin, oh, look at her. So cute. When she's looking like Dayong. Teary eyes. He looked at Wayan. His smile slowly vanished. Wayan, where is he? Jimin, what will you name her? Wayan, her dad will name her. Jimin again looked at her. Wayan, tell me, where is he? He was talking about to go somewhere for a few days. Tell me, when he will come? Jimin, I don't know. Wayan, what do you mean you don't know? Jimin sighed. Wayan, there is something which he didn't tell you. Wayan, what? Jimin, we are not vampire anymore. Wayan eyes widened in shock. Wayan, what? Jimin, it's true. And it is only possible because of you. Wayan, I'm not understanding anything. Jimin, we were, and turned into vampires. We don't want to be a vampire. Just because of one thing, our state turned into vampires. We don't like to. People's time is our king, and he strictly prohibited to any human. We only used to animals, but we don't. Jimin, Taeyong punishes everyone who innocent humans, but there are rivals who like this. They only drank human. We wanted to get rid of it, and there was only one way. The birth of King Harris with a noble. It was not possible because there is only one noble out of thousand. Wen was surprised to hear that. Wen, so now, where he is? Jimin, it was not easy. You know it was risky. Noble can make a vampire stronger, but it was so hard to control and get without drinking. But Taeyong did, and now when the baby is born, he's now unconscious. When? Why? Jimin, we don't know when he will wake up. One day, one week, or one year. When dear fall? Jimin, don't lose hope. Maybe he will be up soon. Bayan, I want to meet him. Jimin, come with me. He made her stand and took her to a room. She entered inside and a sob escaped her mouth when she saw him unconscious. Jimin made her sit near him and went out to give them some space. Wayan, weren't you excited for our baby? Don't you want to meet our little princess? So, Wayan, you were so happy. You told me to take care, but I can't. I'm too weak to handle myself alone. How will I handle baby? Please, I need you. Please wake up. I have to tell you something. Please stay crying. When I need you there. Why are you not opening your eyes, huh? Jimin knocked and came in. Jimin, when baby's crying, when wiped her tears and nodded, she stood up and his forehead. When I'm waiting for you, she said and went out with Jimin.
at late night mine was sleeping with tears on her face but when when someone wiped her tears she leaned more into that touch with close eyes tayo mine opened her eyes and looked at him He was staring lovingly at her. Her eyes got teary. When well, it's a dream, right? Tayong, mm-hmm. He shook his head. When well, touched his face and soap came from his mouth. She hugged him from his stomach while laying. Tayong chuckled and caressed her hairs with teary eyes. He made her said, Why, you were so bad. I, you, why you left me, crying. Tayong, I'm sorry, but I wanted to live with you as a simple person. Why, I missed you so much. It was, I needed you. Tayong, I had to vent. Why, now, don't leave us. Don't you want to see our baby? Tayong, I want to. Badly. Is it a princess or a prince? When guess, Tayong, princess. Why nodded and Tayong, eyes shined. She took the baby from her side and gave her to Tayong. Tayong carefully held her. Tayong, oh my god, she looks like me. Wen nodded with teary eyes. Wen, yes, she looks exactly like her dada. Smile. Tayong, I'm so happy. Wen forehead, then babies. Tayong, she's sleeping. We should not disturb her sleep, right? Wen, hmm, or she will not let us both sleep. Tayong chuckled. He put the baby in her crib and lay down on bed. When put her head on his and closed her eyes. When Taeyong opened his eyes and looked at her, but she was not looking at him. Taeyong, darling, open your eyes and look at me. She looked at him. Taeyong, now say it. When Taeyong smiled and Taeyong. Next day, Tang was playing with baby and Wen was adoring them. Suddenly, two knocked and Jimin came in. She went, you have guessed. Stella came in with a... Wen raised her eyebrow. Wen, how in the world? Shocked. Stella blushed. Stella, you had a baby and you didn't tell me. You betray her. When and you caught? Seriously? Who is he? Who did that? Jimin, I did. Proud. Taehyung and Wen looked shocked at Jimin. Wen, there, I'm going to pass out. Hold me. Taehyung, darling, no worry. Wen, I, sh- I was joking. Stella, I have a surprise for you. Wen, what? Suddenly, someone entered and making Wen eyes teary. When dead, he was smiling and coming to her on his bed without any support. Wen tears for Wen dead, I'm so happy. He hugged Wen. <coughs> Wen dead, I'm happy too because of one day her. I'm perfectly fine. Ian, thanks to you both. Tujuman and Tae, I'm so happy I became a grandpa. Wen smiled. Wen see her. Wen dad sat on bed and Taeyong gave her to him. Wen dad, my princess. Wen was looking at them with teary eyes and Taeyong side hugged her, caressing her arm and there Stella was also looking at them. Jimin smiled and side hugged her, caressing her. Stella looked at him and smiled and after some months Stella gave birth to
a baby boy. They all were happy. Jim and Stella got married and they all live happily. It was my first time writing this type of story. If you didn't like it, so just ignore. The end.